the photogenic award. Male candidate number seven and female candidate number four for the Pure Beauty Collagen Award. And male candidate number three and female candidate number six for the Best in Active Wear. Congratulations!
stand on using surgery to achieve the ultimate body? I think that having surgery is a personal choice. Yes, it is. Um, some people would say that we should be happy and contented with what we have and there's nothing wrong with it. But some people lack confidence because of their body, their looks, and they are not proud of themselves. So if it if having surgery means boosting one's confidence, then why not? It is your body, it is your choice. Good evening. Wow. Ladies and gentlemen, candidate number 10, our first male finalist. To whom do you dedicate your participation in this competition? Um, hello everyone, good evening. First of all, I dedicate this competition to the Lord God Almighty. For without Him, this journey will not be possible. And I dedicate this competition also to my family, friends, for their love and support and giving me an inspiration to do the best that I can. And I would like to extend my gratitude to my handlers, mentors, for their unwavering support and guidance. Thank you. Alright, thank you so much, candidate number three. How will you describe an ultimate body? Ultimate body is not all about being physically fit, but it also having a better health and well-being. Thank you. There you go. Thank you so much, candidate number 11. What advice you can give to people who are struggling to achieve their ultimate body? My advice to those people who struggle to get an ultimate body is having a dedication and hard work. Because I believe through our dedication and hard work, we can easily move forward and advance in life. That's all. Thank you. All right. Very well said, candidate number seven. In a world that we are in right now, how will you inspire people to achieve their ultimate body? Thank you very much. I can inspire people by making myself as a model. As you can see, my hard work, my dedication. I am very thankful uh, to the technology because it makes me more easier to share my journey on how I on how I achieve my ultimate body by being disciplined and at the same time consistent. If I can do it, then you can do it too. That's all, thank you. There you go, thank you so much, candidate number four. Does age define having an ultimate body? For me, age doesn't define having an ultimate body regardless of the numbers of time, days, or the numbers of the or the, the number of your age because if you are passionate about something and doing something that you should garner and you should be kindness about it and you should be hardworking and dedicated to achieve your ultimate body because I do believe in achieving your ultimate body age doesn't matter there you go. what do you think are the requirements to achieve the ultimate you The world is uncertain, and many pathways allow a broad range of skill sets in fitness and healthcare that will engage a room for our personal growth. We individuals can manage through our commitment and being responsible. Primarily, wellness awareness, focusing on proper education, and precise and concise information. Considering all these requirements, we can have a healthy mind that will lead and achieve a healthy body. Above all, if we are truly committed, let us always instill in our heart a healthier you paves the way for a rightful and brighter future with a substance. Thank you. There you go. Thank you so much, candidate number four. What important lesson have you learned in your journey to achieve your ultimate body? I think um, the important lesson that I have learned is that I, I have my self-discipline because this is the highest form of discipline and I think when you have discipline to yourself, um, motivation, inspiration, hard work, and patience will follow. As, um, it also follows the self-love which means you want the betterment of yourself. So. 
ladies and gentlemen, ultimate body is not just about having a perfect shape. It is about having an ultimate personality, um, uh, being a good well-being, and also an ultimate confidence. That will be all, and thank you. Very good. Thank you so much. Candidate number six, when does aiming your ultimate body end? It does not end. For some, achieving their ultimate body may have a definitive end point once they reach their goals. But for others, like me, it is an ongoing process of maintaining and improving myself to achieve a healthier and happier you. Very good. Thank you so much, candidate number one. What is your favorite experience in your journey in this competition? My favorite journey actually was right after the media launch that we had. I had the opportunity to have a talk with Madame BPC to actually know how Ultimate Body really came to be. And I'm really grateful and blessed to be a part of something that was once a dream came to a reality. Thank you. There you go, ladies and gentlemen. A big round of applause to our fifth finalist candidate. Body 2023 first runner-up is female. 